Welcome to the Meet the HRH team series. My name is Araminta Johnson and I work with Heather Hayes and Associates Inc. Meet the team is a series of interviews where we meet and get to know all of the core people within the Heather Hayes and Associates team. Today, it gives me great pleasure to welcome Corinne Brown, who has just started at HRH as a clinical family support specialist. Hi, Corinne. Hi, nice to see you. <laughs> Lovely to see you too. So talk to me a little bit about your role at HRH. Sure. Uh, I work as a clinical family sports specialist, which is someone who comes alongside families who have a loved one um, either considering entering treatment or already in treatment and just being alongside them for the process and um, helping them understand what their loved one might be going through while in treatment and also just even helping them um, and being a support person for them while they're going through the process of helping get someone to treatment. Fabulous. And talk to me a little bit about um, your experience within the mental health and addiction industry. I've been in the field for a little over 15 years. I'm dually licensed in clinical uh, addiction specialist and a licensed mental health counselor. I have been working in both private practice settings and also residential treatment for young adults and adolescents. Um, in trauma-informed care, I'm also a certified trauma therapist as well. And so in the later years of my clinical work, I've really um, focused on uh, trauma, trauma treatment, trauma healing. Amazing. Thank you. And what are the values you would say that drive you in your work? Family, for sure. I have a loved one in recovery. I also um, have just really appreciated the entire family going through either mental illness or substance use and addiction and the impact that um, being a part of community. So community is certainly a value of mine, as well as um, just connection and love and care for humans. <laughs> Yeah, lovely. Great, great values. I completely agree with you. And who inspired you to pursue the career you have today? Or if no one inspired you to pursue this career, who just generally inspires you? Oh, I love that question. Um, I would say my students and young people inspired me. I had been a teacher and a coach for my early years um, in career work and also um been involved in sports and athletics for so many years and played soccer myself in college. But I would say young people gravitated and at-risk young people gravitated towards opening up to me. And I just felt as though it was my responsibility to learn more about how best to support them. And so I really kind of, that's just the domino effect of what led me into different um, programs in undergrad and graduate work were really centered around um, youth, child development, family studies, and um, and psychology, and just understanding human relationships and behavior. Mm, great, great inspiration there. Um, and what is the best advice you can give to someone who is struggling either with their mental health or with addiction issues? I would say um, to lean into the help that's offered and know that there is support out there and that there is so much more awareness. There's such greater awareness around mental health and substance use and addiction now. And there are a lot of people out there who are really skilled and trained to help. And I believe that it's very hard to know who and what to trust in the process and that um, you cannot do recovery alone of any kind and so you really need to lean into the support that's provided. Yeah, 100% agree with you there um, and what do you enjoy doing when you're not working? <laughs> I love gardening um, especially with my mother and um, being outdoors and I'm a runner and also love to cook and my nephews I have three nephews who are my world and so I enjoy spending time with them, just even if it's FaceTime, seeing their face light up. Great. And the last question that no one really likes to answer, but here it is. What is your secret talent that no one knows about? <laughs> wow. 
Okay, my secret talent. Oh, gosh. I don't know. I might have to think about that one for a minute. Well, actually, you told me at the beginning of this conversation that you played soccer. And I think that's quite a, a quite an impressive talent. Yes. How many keepy uppies can you do? Do you say that in the <laughs> like a... oh, Yeah, I love that. I love that. Juggles. I actually won in middle school a juggling contest. I do not remember the number, but um, it's not a secret talent. Be but however, it is a, definitely a talent. <laughs> a great talent as well. One that I wouldn't have uh, thought of if I, when I first met you. So amazing. Thank you so much, Corin. It has been a pleasure talking to you um, and welcome to the HRH team. Thank you. Thank you so much.